So this is lab four, the squalus acanthius, which is the shark dissection. Um, first looking at the epaxial muscles, which are right here. And we, right below that, right below the horizontal septum, which is underneath the lateral line, is the hypaxial muscles. Each little segment is our myomeres. In between are broad lines, which are known as myoseptums. So the adductor mandibulae is located right here on the shark. The levator palate palato quadrati is right cranial to the spiracle. Right underneath of that is the spiracle muscle, which is this little flap almost. The levator hyomandibulae is right caudal to the spiracle right here. The dorsal hyoid constrictor is this little portion right here. And then the ventral hyoid constrictor would be right here. The dorsal superficial brachial constrictors are right above the gill arches right here. Likewise, the ventral superficial brachial constrictors are right here. The, cro the crocomandibular is the crocomandibular is his first is his first thick tube. Right underneath of that is the crocohyoid, and following down caudally is the crocoarchials. The cupularis, cupularis seen on this shark, is located right here. And in comparison, just looking at our shark, which is significantly smaller, our cupularis is faintly right here. The intermandibular on our shark is this first layer. And the inner hyoid muscle is right here. It's right underneath, right above the intermandibular, the inner hyoid muscles. The superficial dorsal fin muscle is located on the pectoral fin on the vent on the dorsal side, right here. The ventral fin muscles is on the likewise on the pectoral fin and on the ventral side. And that's the end of the shark dissection.